Hello friends welcome to a new episode of bikini and lingerie review the purpose of this channel is to help you in selecting the best bikini or lingerie for you or for your partner based on the design material used and comfort as always we came up with nine set of bikinis in this video and in the last we will choose the best one for you if you are new here don't forget to subscribe my channel and turn on all notifications so that you can get the latest videos as soon as they will be uploaded also please subscribe to the channels of these lovely ladies for which links can be found in descriptions Thanks and keep enjoying and do let me know what next you want to see. Okay, so this one is kind of odd. I did pick it up without trying it on because I thought it would just be like good to go. Um, but now that I have it on, this top I don't really like. I'm liking the bottoms a lot. I like the way they're cut. But this middle part here keeps getting tangled. Um, so that's kind of annoying. If the top is a small and the bottoms are large, so I'm not really a good candidate when it comes to bikinis that are sold online that come just like in one size because I'm always a different size in the top and a different size in the bottom. Um, so I don't really like this top, but I really like the color of it, um, the color scheme, and it's a really nice like soft velvety material. So I'll definitely be wearing the bottoms, but I don't know about the top. I mean, I could always wear it just to like go suntan by the pool. Um, I feel like this also might give me like a really weird uh, suntan. So I'm gonna definitely be wearing these, but yeah, the top is like eh, not that great. It is from Pink. It has the little pink, little pink metal logo right here. And it also has it on the back. You can feel it here. Um, the top was $9.99, it's a size small, the bottoms were a $9.99 and they're large, so the price is really good on the swimwear there, so you can't beat that. But yeah, overall it's, it's like a cute color. Um, I also got a bra with like this similar color pattern on it, and I'm going to show you guys in a second. El siguiente bikini que os quería enseñar es este, que es como veis, pues un bikini con un estampado de rayas blancas y de un color turquesa así oscurito. Este bikini me parece súper chulo, creo que he acertado también con la talla y es que este lo pillé en la talla S, no en la talla M. ¿Por qué? Porque vi que de pecho cubría bastante, que era, vi que era un bikini bastante ancho y entonces en esos casos cuando son bikinis que cubren muchísimo sí que me pillo la talla S. Es un bikini de tiro bajo, como podéis ver, tiene también sus tirantes completamente ajustables, que esto está genial, pero es que además se los puedes quitar. Por si quieres tomar el sol y no quieres que se te quede la marca de los tirantes, pues te los puedes quitar y poner cuando quieras. Que además algo que me gusta muchísimo y que me ha sorprendido para el precio que tienen estos bikinis es que este, como tiene para quitar y poner los tirantes, tiene como los típicos sujetadores que no tienen tirantes, que llevan un plastiquito por dentro para que se pegue completamente a la piel y no se te baje. Pues esto lo lleva este bikini. Y es algo que me, me ha dejado bastante sorprendida. Por eso os decía antes que yo con los detalles de cada bikini he flipado porque yo me esperaba bikinis mucho más sencillitos para el precio que tienen. Este como todos también tiene el pequeño relleno por dentro que se lo puedes quitar. Holy shit, this is a nice bikini. It looks way better on me than it did when I got it out of the packet, that's for sure. It goes really nice with my new tan as well, like really nice. I'm hoping that this is gonna look as good when I am editing this video as it does like on the viewfinder right now because my body looks amazing in this. I absolutely love micro bikinis and I'm falling more and more in love with them every month that goes by. I love tanning in micro bikinis because there's just hardly any tan lines. You get almost your whole body except for this sexy little white pattern on your nipples and your 
and that to me is just so hot. I still feel like this isn't as like micro as the first gold one I tried on a year back, but it's still very tiny. But I think this could be a little better for public situations because those micro bikinis are really dangerous. This one just has that little bit extra material, like especially around my hair. <laughs> I feel like I would be more confident to wear this out with people around me because I hate having to constantly be like this, you know, making sure that everything's covering me properly. I'm trying to decide whether I want to do the try on with any shoes on, like any heels, but I think this one is just perfect by itself. Like I just want to pretend I'm on a beach in Miami, it's a super hot day and I'm just getting a killer turn and I would not be wearing heels if I was doing it. Yeah, let's model this gold bikini because it is sexy as I'm so obsessed with this bikini set. Comment down below and let me know if you love this gold one as much as I do. And if you can remember that gold micro bikini from Yandy that I tried on like over a year ago, comment and let me know whether you prefer that one or this one. And don't forget, I will be trying on that gold one. Um, <laughs> this is so confusing. That gold one from the video a year ago that I donated. I reordered the exact same one. So I will be trying that on again. I'm going to be doing like a Yandy micro bikini haul. I cannot wait for that one. Okay, so I just noticed my nipple was out, which is super annoying because that means I'm gonna have to blur my YouTube video. You definitely will have to be cautious if you wear this to the beach, um, but it's so worth it because I think this is so eye-catching and I'm honestly gonna give it a 10 out of 10. It's good quality, the perfect gold color. Pasamos al cuarto bikini y es este que es también de color verde, pero es un verde bastante diferente al que os he enseñado antes. Es también así como de rayas, pero es completamente diferente. La parte de arriba es como triangular, también tiene los tirantes ajustables, que eso me encanta. Y la parte de abajo tiene como estas pequeñas aberturas en los lados, que le da un toquecito bastante guay, la verdad. Este tengo que decir que es de los bikinis de este haul que he visto de más calidad. Me gusta muchísimo. La parte de abajo es así de tiro bajo, pero la parte de arriba, como os decía, es así como triangular. Creo que no sienta tan bien para pecho grande. Yo noto que yo me noto muy apretada y eso es algo que no me gusta demasiado. Tengo un dilema ahí, es como que me gusta, pero siento que para mi tipo de cuerpo quizá no es el que mejor me sienta, pero aún así sé que me lo voy a poner. 
Pero si tenéis menos pecho seguro que os va a quedar muchísimo mejor, estoy segurísima. Y que tampoco hace falta que te quede un bikini perfecto para poder ponértelo. So this bikini fits me so well. That's what I love about these like string tie ones around the neck, the waist and on the thong because you can adjust it to fit your body type. Like I said, this is a size small and I am so, so happy with how it looks on my body. The top gives me a decent amount of cleavage, which I am really happy about because I hate it when I look flat chested in a bikini top, even though I have double Ds. This gives you just the perfect amount of lift to show that you have some shape. And of course, I love any bottoms that are thong style. It's just, in my opinion, the most flattering for my body type. So I'm super impressed with this Shein bikini. I never normally wear like this bright blue color either. And it's so much fun. It looks really nice with my strawberry, bl strawberry blonde hair. I kind of want to put on some heels with this outfit because it's just so hot but I don't know like I imagine myself wearing this when I get to Sydney if I get to Sydney long story I'll probably tell you in a future video but yeah I could imagine myself wearing this on like Bondi Beach or something and I definitely wouldn't be wearing heels with that either so maybe I'll just wear heels with the last pink micro bikini instead okay let's model this bikini because I am keen to put one of my new favorite no copyright songs on and dance for you guys. It's the calm before the storm. Things aren't as they were before. You best start bracing. Did you think you could keep us out? Shut the gates and get us now. Starts to change El último bikini es este que es de color naranja súper fosforito. Tengo que decir que no me lo esperaba tan fosforito. En las fotos de la página web no se ve tan fosforito, ya os lo digo, se ve de un naranja bastante más sutil. La parte de abajo me queda un poquito grande, algo que bueno, puede ser normal porque es una talla M y como os digo, yo suelo usar una talla S abajo. Lo raro es que las otras tallas M, como veis, sí que me iban bien. Entonces es un poco raro, no sé. Y luego, la parte de arriba es súper bonita, pero noto que no es muy cubriente, noto que no cubre todo lo que me gustaría. Y eso que, pues, lo que os comentaba, escogí una vez más la talla M para que me cubriese más que una S y no ha sido el caso. Entonces, tengo que decir que el bikini me parece súper bonito, a pesar de que el color no es como me lo esperaba, pero es un bikini que para mí no es. Um, my top sort of holds the back part down. It's a new technique. I don't know which way you're meant to put them on, but this looks okay. I really need to do a photo shoot in this micro bikini. It is so pretty. This was the one that was gifted to me off of my Amazon wish list. 
Um, I'm not going to mention his name. I don't know whether he would want me to or not, but thank you so much. I love it. It's amazing, just as I knew it would be. It feels like really good quality. It's fitting my body nicely. It's not sticking out too much at the back, which sometimes happen with, happens with slingshot bikinis, but that's why I decided to put the top over the top of it. So this would sort of like keep it down at my waist but of course i love the color it's like this perfect barbie pink color with little diamantes on them it's super barbie and it goes so well with my hair and makeup as well and my tan so i'm loving this overall look i'm definitely gonna wear heels with this i'm thinking just my clear heels just something nice and simple but to just make it a little more sexy Okay, I went and grabbed the clear heels. I usually wear some kind of socks with these. I really don't want to have to do any blurring, so I hope my nipples have stayed in while I've been talking. Um, yeah, I usually wear like cute little frilly socks or something with these, but I just want to wear them with nothing today because I just want to really draw attention to the outfit and not my feet. Okay, so that is it for my new bikini try on haul video. I hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. Please like this video and comment down below and let me know what your favorite bikini was from this try on haul. Please like this video. It really helps with getting my content out there and shown on people's For You pages. Thanks so much for watching. Check the description box below for more information. I will see you guys next week in my next video. So friends, depending on the material, design, fit and finish, we choose this bikini as a winner for today's try on haul. Do let me know which one is your favorite.